Hey everybody, what is going on? It's Brian with you from the Game Cabin, and we are playing some more RimWorld. So before we get into the actual game, uh, let me preference this video by saying uh, I've been playing around. I've literally spent like, I think I'm at like two hours now, playing around with settings on videos, and I was tweaking some of my overclocking settings, and I was just trying to get the most out of my videos. Um, I was playing around with like the encoder, um, and I ended up recording like two episodes, and I it, they, it turned out to be a little bit laggy, in addition, it was like 4 gig file size, which is just like a little on the ridiculous side. And, and I think part of it is I was playing around with 60 frames a second, and I don't know. But right now, my computer, I don't know, is up to spec to handle that. In addition to it, I just don't know that 4 gigs like is going to be a bit problematic because I'm with a uh, uh, ISP that limits my data each month, which is really ridiculous. So because of that, um, I decided, screw it, we're going to go back to the old encoder we're using. We went back to 30 frames a second. I ended up bumping the bitrate up, so it should look a little bit better. So um, go ahead in the comments. Let me know if you notice any difference. Let me know if uh, you like this better or if it doesn't really matter or whatnot. Um, but because of all of that, let me say, uh, I actually have kind of played a couple episodes already, and I kind of know what I want to do with um, this colony, which is maybe a good thing or maybe a bad thing. But first and foremost, I'm going to go ahead and unforbid a, a few of these things. And Skylar's currently hauling, hauling things around. And I want her to go ahead and prioritize hauling that. In addition, we have a gun here. And I'm going to also go ahead and start getting some fine meals going. Um, I probably should have been doing this a little bit a while ago. But anyways, we're going to go ahead and have Benico get some of our fine meals um, going. Uh, I would like to start finishing this room as quick as possible. And probably tomorrow, we're going to start moving this table over here. Uh, just to kind of have an indoor area where people can eat. Um, I don't know why I want it indoors. Well, I mean, at whatever. We're trying to move it in there. Eventually, it's going to be prettier. Uh, in addition to that, I'm going to come here to and build a electric tailoring bench. I would also like to get a few uh, stools here for people to sit on as they're working. I should have done that a while ago. And we need to get some clothing going. So I'm going to go ahead and get another growing zone. And hopefully... Yeah, let's just do by eight. Hopefully we can actually get some cotton before winter kicks in. And so I think we're going to go ahead and leave all that there. A couple other things I want to do is I'm going to go ahead and adjust Benico's work schedule because we hadn't had a chance to do that. And I'm going to change Skylar back to um, give her a little more time hauling um, just because I need as much help as possible hauling. In addition to all of that, let's keep Walter. We're going to switch Walter to a miner. We're going to switch Tuco from a miner to a plant cutter because I need a bunch of wood. And we're going to keep Hank as our constructor. So I'm going to come over here and I'm going to have Tuco start cutting a whole bunch of the wood that's over here. That is eventually going to be our kill zone. But we're not there yet. So all that being said, I think this is where we need to be right now. So let's go ahead and advance time. Um, Benico, I'm happy you're building these, uh, making these meals, but I think I need you to actually prioritize butchering right now. Um, I, I wish I could prioritize butchering over cooking, but there doesn't seem to be a way to actually do that. Uh, I probably should have finished carrying that meat. Whoopsie. Hey, Skylar, you want to haul that meat? I kind of screwed that up. Benico... He's going to, con yeah, okay, we're good. Just want to get all this meat um, cut up before it, like, spoils. So, anyways, uh, Benico is, what the heck are you doing now? Oh, there's a dead one. Uh, Gus got the flu. All right, good. So, Gus, we're going to go ahead and switch your bed to a medical bed, and we're going to tell you, go sleep in there until you get better. Uh, the other thing I want to start doing is I want to start hauling out over here, hauling, <laughs> mining out over here. Something like that for the time being. How's our bedroom coming? Walter's currently cutting our bedroom. The other thing we're going to do is we're going to end up making a hallway that's going to connect these two. Um, first, I want him to finish this bedroom, though. The other thing is I would like all this crap to start disappearing, please. Get rid of it. I, it's ugly, and it doesn't fit in my space. Please. Thank you. All right, walls. We want a wall here, and we're going to put a door here because, like I said, this is going to be a hallway eventually. Not right now. In addition, let's go ahead and start actually build the entrance to our other part of the colony. Eventually, all this will connect together, but that's going to be a little bit down the road. Uh, so 
we do have this room currently done-ish, quote unquote. So I am gonna go ahead and after everyone eats breakfast, gonna move all this over here. We only have one fine meal for tomorrow and we only... I screwed up. I forgot to do this. <laughs> ah, dang it. Ugh. All right, sorry, Benico. So he's gonna be pissed because he slept in the cold and on the ground. Why would you sleep in the freezer, man? Just wondering. I guess he just got so tired with life. Uh, you're good on rest, man. Get to work. <laughs> uh, actually, you know what? Screw this. I don't even want you to relax. I just want you to cook. We need to cook, man. I want everyone to have happy meals. I wonder if it's better to put a door right here. It might actually be worth it. Let's go ahead and tell someone to put a door here. And by someone, that's of course Hank. Um, Hank, I would like to go ahead and start uh, building some of these. We're gonna start putting these over here for the time being. B, R, B, uh, and no R. And let's get some of these chairs moved, please. Uh. And we're going to get the chairs moved, and then we're going to move the table. I would like to move the chairs first, just so once I move the table, they have a place to sit at. Um, hey, yo, come back over here. Prioritize working. And work on that one. Nope, dang it. Work on that one. All right. So now with that one, let's go ahead and reinstall the table over here. Please. Oh, we had to actually move that first. Eh, all right. Well, there you go. And then lastly, let's go move. Cancel. No. B R B R B R R and B R. All right. Cool. Hank, uh, can you finish that, please? Pretty please. No. All right. I'm gonna have to manually tell you how to do everything. That's cool. <laughs> I wish. I don't know. I just wish there's a way to prioritize like work order. Okay. Now we have our dining room inside. Sweet. Um, other thing we should go ahead and start doing in here is let's get some standing lamps going in here. We'll put one here. We'll put one here. Um, I think Hank's going and getting some wood, which is good. Um, the other thing we need to go ahead and start doing too, or, or rather adjust, is we're going to put a door here. Um, it'll make sense when we actually start building this out. But um, how do we end up doing it? I think it was like do, 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 doom, doom, doom. I think that's what we ended up doing with our bedroom. So it's gonna be do, 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 yeah. And then dunk, 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 dunk. Yeah, that'll be perfect. So go like this. And hopefully we'll start getting all that taken care of sooner rather than later. Um, I would like to get these lamps built indoors pretty soon, Hank, you know. That works. Can you actually get me this built soon, please? Because I'd actually like to get um, some power so this isn't like a dark room that people are sitting in. Uh, we will need to run some power over here. We're just going to run it through the wall because... Dang it. Should I run through this wall? Actually, yeah. Let's just run through this wall. That'll make more sense. So something like that. And then let's just power conduit down here. Do, 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 do. Something over here. And they should both be able to connect maybe? No, they won't. Uh, all right, fine. We'll do it like this too. And hopefully Hank can get all that taken care of. Um, our other bedroom is currently ready to go. So let us structure wall. Boom, boom, boom. And we'll have all that built. Um, Walter's currently, he's just like, I'm basically working on another bedroom over here. That's kind of my plan. Uh, just another little tiny little bedroom. Eventually, I guess those will be cells, maybe medical rooms. I don't know. Maybe we'll just knock a couple walls out and make them really big. For now, I'm not too concerned. Um, we have decent number of food. We have uh, we have okay amount of meals, so that's all right. Components and everything are looking good. Oh, since we finished the table, I need to actually start getting some of this built. So first thing is I need some jackets. And actually, the thing is, I don't have enough resources to do either of these. So I do need six um, Turks or two Ks. I don't know how you say them yet. And I'm going to make seven parkas as well. The problem is I can't do either of them because I don't have the resources. Um, I'm like just short on leather. 
uh, it was like 120 leather, and all I have is 118 beaver skin. So we're a little short there, um, and I don't think we have cloth anywhere. I'm trying to think where cloth shows up under. I think cloth might show up under here, under textiles. I think so. That's all wolf skin, wolf skin, wolf skin. Yeah. I think it appears under there. I'm not 100% sure, though. So, I would like to get you guys moving these rocks sooner rather than later, pretty please. Skylar, you're consuming a fine meal. You're hauling marble. Thank you. I mean, this is really like an ugly room right now, so I'd very much like you to focus on that. Where is she doing now? She's hauling marble chunk. Okay, I don't want you to haul the wood. Just FYI. Hauling alpaca wool. Hauling duster. See, that's the stuff that I'm not really interested in you doing right now. Just get me my marble chunks moved. And the wood. Like, that's the other thing. I don't care about you. I mean, I could restrict it, but then I can't build with it. So it's just like, I don't know. There you go. Like, just keep cleaning this up, please. Um, who's currently cleaning? I think it's Jessie, but it's only when she's done planting, and we're having a lot of... That muffalo just ate some of my freaking plant, you punks. She's currently pretty busy there, so we're not really getting much of anything done there. Um, we do have plenty of wood now, so our construction should be going okay. Walter's almost done mining, so what we're going to go ahead and do is have you start mining out over here as well. Uh, we're gonna keep this as our wall, so we're gonna go five wide down to here. That's gonna be one, and then we're gonna come here for five wide. And the reason we're going five wide so we can put like heaters and lamps in the hallway, just keep it a little bit bigger. So Walter will almost be done with this, and we could go ahead and construct another bedroom in here. I guess, I guess I might as well. There's no reason not to wait, right? Something like this. And then another little tiny bed in here. And that'll be good for future times. Um, it's probably down quite a bit on the queue because of all these other things we're trying to construct. But yeah. We do also want to start... Well, we want to finish this wall first off. Man, I think Tuco is just taking forever to cut plants because he's so terrible at it. Uh, I, wonder, I wonder if reversing something. So Tuco is 11 on hunting. Um, his construction's trash. His mining is five. Right now, our miner is Walter, who has an eight mining. Can he cut plants any better? Doesn't really look like it. So, <laughs> so it wouldn't really change anything. The only thing would be potentially Hank. Nah. They're all pretty terrible. They're equally terrible at it, so. What I really need is I need... Oh, snap. You know what I forgot to do? I need to get Skylar to actually... Yeah, I need Skylar to actually do some research now. So we're going to bump her to two on hauling and cleaning. Just because I would like to get my turrets done with sooner rather than later. So we'll have her work on that. Everything else is going okay for the time being. Um, the other thing is we need to go ahead and have all these doors forced open. The reason for that is you'll notice like this bedroom right here is 57 degrees. Um, this bedroom that has the open door is 68 degrees. So the heater is doing a good job of keeping all this warm. Um, unfortunately, it's just not going through these doors when they're open or closed. So we'll want to keep all those doors open. And they don't take any negative for having an open bedroom door. So I, it makes sense. I'm, I, I guess as a kid, I would use, I would sleep with my door open sometimes. It just all depends. You know, you, you like your privacy, but if you're in a small bedroom or in your weird part of the house, sometimes it'll always get too hot or too cold in my bedroom. And I'm pretty picky about my temperature when it sleeps. Like, it has to be, like, within a certain degree or else I'm kind of like, eh, eh. Like, seriously, we sleep at, like, 65 degrees. I said it every night right now during, quote-unquote, summer or almost fall if if it gets like 66 degrees i will wake up sweating in the middle of the night it's a little weird i know uh did i actually go ahead and i forgot if i did in here but i would actually like to build a roof i did not do it um but we want to build a roof over here just in case um we have any rain or whatever i don't know if any of these would uh, malfunction or you know whatever so let's just get a roof over the top of those um almost looks all our construction's almost done our bedroom's almost done in here too Yay. 
Uh, okay, I need structure, wood wall, and wood wall. Good job, Hank. And we do need to uh, mine this out. And this one's a little important for me. Come mine over here. And then we can finish this bedroom. Structure, or sorry, furniture. Bedroom. Boom. Uh, I would like all of this crap to move out of here. Pretty please. Haul you. And haul all you. And what else are we going to build in this bedroom? Oh, actually, no. I miss. I screwed this up. I actually want this here. Thank you. I don't know what's squeaking and dying. Oh, a rat just died over here. All right. Tuco, can you haul the dead rat? Uh, we are also out of meat, or we're about to be out of meat, so let's go ahead and get a couple other things hunted, so let's queue them up, not the wood, <laughs> let's hunt the wood, hunt, hunt, and hunt, and that should give us a little more meat to last us a couple more days, uh, where is Benico, what are you currently working on, you're cooking simple meal, I need you to, yeah, there you go, get the meat going, Walter's finishing mining down there. That's fine. We almost have our other bedroom done. How is Gus doing? We finished gun turns. Boom. Um, next thing we're going to do, we're going to do drug products. As much as I want stone cutting, we're going to do drug products because I want drugs. <laughs> uh, I mean, the whole reason we're doing this is to make a... I need to refuel you. Is to make ourselves... God, don't walk through the gunshots. He has a 12 freaking shooting. But because he has the freaking pistol, it takes forever to kill these things. Interesting. Where are you going? You're going to rest? Yeah, sure. That stuff will survive the night. Someone else is hunting. Jesse, with the rifle. Jesse, who has a gun. Gus is currently sleeping on the floor. Oh, Gus woke up. Hey! Does that mean, does that mean you no longer have the flu? Yeah, okay. So what that means is, let's go ahead and put you back on two, and let's get you back on one and one. Okay, um, how much sleep? Eh, you'll be fine. Okay, so I need to also finish this power here. Apparently I'm having some issues doing that. Low medicine, I don't have three medicine left in storage. Yeah, yeah, I know. We're working on that. So we have gun turrets now, so... We still have a lot of construction left to do. I think what we're going to go ahead and start doing is... Let's go ahead and switch Hank, or Walter rather, back to one on construction. And let's actually get the construction knocked out. I don't care so much about this mining anymore. Um, I would like to actually see the rest of this construction finish. Um, yeah, I think that room is somewhat important. Actually, you know what? That room is less important now that I have this one done. Getting that bed done is going to be more important. How is our wood? We do have quite a bit of wood over here, so we should have enough wood to haul everything and finish what we need. Um, but I think we're going to wrap this episode up here since we're on a new day. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like, go ahead and comment, and hit that subscribe button. Join the comments, show your support, uh, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye.